everyone, welcome back to the part two of opening all these Bakugan products, and now we're up to the starter set. Actually, the first and last starter set opening of the year, unless I find the other two of this wave, which I want to do, because one of them has an Auralis Bakugan, and that means Auralis cards, and I could just, I just noticed, I just noticed you guys could have just, you just saw me, the reflection in. And I think we're about to... Alright. So, anyway, let's get opening this packet. Doesn't look like there's tags, so I can actually put away the clippy thing. Probably, if you're wondering what that noise is, it's my dad walking upstairs. Alright, because I'm going to use this box to carry all the Bakugan back upstairs, because I like these box designs, because they're all so convenient. Oh no, I just noticed it's not the same design as before. That sucks! I like designs from before. Uh, anyway, this is like the first starter pack I found all year, because I could not find the others. Oh, no. And here's why, because, oh, I forgot about the rule book, because this will have the back of gear rule book. This will have what to do with the back of gears. Even though I figured it out. <laughs> okay, here's the cores. Don't care about, oh man, the cores have actually gone so big, I'm just going to have to put them on top now. So, oh, it does have a tag. Alright, so... I was actually hesitant buying this, even though it's the first one I found all year. Why? Well, two of the three of the Bakugan are we already seen. Like, Hydra's Ultra. I mean, we've already had a Hydra's Ultra come out this year. And not only him, there's also... Oh, that was easy. There was also this guy right here. Which is Aventus Nilius, which was in the previous core set. I mean... The only reason I bought it was for this guy. Pyrus Maxodon. Look at him. I got I bought it for an elephant. Named Stampy. Who wanna buy th this packet for an elephant? It's so great. But I also bought it because let's face it, it's the only one. And I hope we can get some great stuff. Let's see what's in here. Alright. So uh, that's it at the back. Alright, so we got the character cards right there. Um, I want to see the rule book real quick. Come out. So here's the rule book, which we're finally getting a look at for the first time in this video. Uh, blah, 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 blah. We already know about these rules. Blah, 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 blah. Ah, crap. Uh... Ooh, what's this? Victor Face. Winner of the Brawl sets their open back on, on the character card and is named the... Okay. So, here's the part I want to know about. Here we go. Baku Gear. Because we I never learned how to do Bakugan properly. Let's see. How Baku Gear works in card game. Uh, you, while building your deck, Baku Gear works like any other card. You can only have three of each. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Also, gear cards have a faction, which means, yeah... Uh-huh. Core. Yeah, I figured that's how it works. Watch some Bakugan cores that do... Tip. Watch some Bakugan cores that reduce, yeah. When you play a Bakugan gear card to attach it underneath the character card, you play it. Okay. Keep a few things in mind. You can play Bakugan gear on characters that don't match its faction. Ooh, that's good. I've actually been doing that for my Oralist cards. You can only have one back of gear attached to a character. Okay. If you ever play a second gear on a character, you must choose one to two gears to... Oh, okay, that part I want to know. Fusion Macogon. Okay. It's even got Fusion Macogon. Oh, and here's the... Rule set. All right. See? I was right. So the V means victor. The Macogon who wins the role is the victor. And draw. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah. So... 
That is the rule. So that's official cardboard. I'm, I'm actually glad we finally get to have a look at that. Except one thing. You're 12 months late! <laughs> anyway, let's have a look at these character cards. We already know about these two, but this guy we want to know about. Maxodon, 200 B power, 2 crit. Grants 300 B power if he lands on a helix core and grants double strike. That I like! That I like! Maxodon's the best! Maxodon's the best! Oh man, I'm, I'm not even... You know, I might keep the other two character cards somewhere safe. Now let's have a look at this pile. Okay, this is like the character card. Uh, let's see. Crap, um... Where is it? It's somewhere near here, I know that. Oh, here it is. Oh, what's that? Did I cut myself? I think I cut myself. Uh, crap, I can't cut it. Hang on. Hang on. Okay, fine. Alright, got it, damn thing. Alright. Let's have a look at these guys. So we got the Chaos Smasher, which we had looked at earlier. Back of Strength. Um, I think I got this already, but it looks cool still. 1300 B power. Kobo's Rules! Ah, I like his design and how Lightning's just like... Huh? <laughs> Enlightened Focus. Alright. Ooh, Aerial Quake. This is a fusion. Trifecta. If your back Bakugou has three or more Bakugou cores attached to them... Ooh, me likey. Oh, there comes with rares. Green Shields. This is a Bakugou gear. Wait, what's that mean? What the hell does that mean? Okay. Does that mean two blade? Two back of gears? That sounds cool. Um, back of cavalry? Uh huh. I'm not gonna read them all. Couple clones. Ventus football. Footfall. I almost said football, but alright. Strategic smash. Uh, back of gear warrior. Wow. Wait a minute. Is he holding. She's holding two back of gears. There's actually a possibility of doing that? Fusion Shield, uh, Heotus Energy. Oh, that is dope! That is dope! I'm reading this. This means this card can be attached to a character as a second Baku gear. Damn! My hands! Wait, there's no Pyrus. Oh, no, wait, there's the Pyrus. Ventus Destruction, uh, Chaotic Booster. Oh, this is another one. This is another one. Ventus ability, Ventus, Fusion Ventus Defense, uh, another Hayatus Energizer, Bakubia, Meteor or Sting, <laughs> Vento Piercer, I think we already had a look at that guy, Baku Booted, this is the only Pyrus card in here? Vento Shield, oh, this destroys Baku Gear, damn! Oh man, I'm liking these abilities, yeah, I'm liking these. I am so updating my decks after this video. I am so updating them. Oh, man. Oh, I enjoyed doing that. I actually missed doing that. How long did that take? All right. So, let's get to the final one. The final packet. All right, last but not least is the two battle packs. All right, we already opened one in the previous video. So, we got two more right here. So, the first one is the Saba Peruvian, which is this one right here, and a Halcor Serpenty, which is right here. Wait a minute. There's two of them? I mean, let me have a look, because I think we could have gone Halcor. No. What else is that? Okay. Oh, it also comes with a Dragonite to Taurus and a Cr Hydranoid Krakilos. All right. So let's open this up. All right, because, yeah, it looks like two of them are oralists, so it's good. I uh, need a knife. Here we go. We're back using the Noi knife. Uh... Ah. This is gonna be fun. 
Alright, so we're gonna get the abilities out of the way. Get the damn tape off. Cause there's no fusion macro on right here. Yeah, they're not think that clearly at the back of course. <laughs> So many cores! Ah. Alright, so this is the instructions for the Viridian Saba and How Core Sympathy, which I'll definitely keep. So, whoa! That is dope. That is something they didn't, I didn't expect them to do. What the heck does that mean? I'm gonna flip these over. So, first up, we got Hydronoid Craculos. With 600 B power, costs 3 energy to fuse and 2 crit. Once fused, it, this is what he looks like. Damn! This thing is scary. Next up is Hi Dragonoid Tutorus. There's actually a, a Pyrostarchus one out somewhere. I'm going to try and find it. It's 600 B power, 3 crit, costs 3 energy to fuse. So let's have a look at it. Whoa! 12. Oh, yeah, I forgot. 900 B, 6 crit, yeah. 1200 B power and 5 crit, and I love that design! It's a robot dragon! I love that design. Brevian Saba Ultra. Wait, what? Sabra? Uh. That looks like Nilius. Isn't that Nilius? Sabra Brevian Ultra. 700 B power, 1 crit, costs 5 energy to fuse, and... Whoa! 800 B power, 12 crit! Damn! But seriously, I'm fused. Doesn't that look like Nilius? Alright, How Core Serpent Z Ultra, costs 7 700 B power, 2 crit, costs 5 energy to fuse, and... Damn! 1100 B power, 4 crit. Damn! Alright, the abilities they come with is Unholy Bow, with 100 B power, 1 crit. What does this mean? Seriously. Alright. Burn Cutter. 100 B power, 5 crit. Uh, improvised Armor. Ooh, not bad. And Bright Flame. I'm not sure what... Okay. So, of course, put the character cards together. And put the abilities together. Then, and now let's have a look at these back again. Because I really want to have a look at them. All right, switching the knife so I can get these two out. All right. All right. Ooh, does he have? Ah, nuts, he has two tags. And I think the gear has a tag too. They all have tags. Ugh. Thank you, Bakugan, for be making it annoying to get Bakugan out of the package. There we go. Alright. This is what I like about the battle packs, because it's easy to clean up afterwards. It's so easy to clean up afterwards. Okay, so here's Brivian Ultra and Halcor. Damn, I, I like the designs. The designs are actually cool. I mean, and then there's the new gear, which I just closed up. It just reminds me of an older Baku gear. Let's see, let's see how it goes on. Cause it's pre, cause it's the fusion, Pyrus fusions. Um, ooh, that's interesting. Which, are we, oh. So, of course, the two big guns go on like so. That seems like it's a one gun back of gun. <laughs> and then. Yeah. Damn. It, this just reminds me of that old back of gear Helios had, if you all remember. Alright, so let's have a look at these new guys. So, this is Krakulos Hydronoid. Which I might have done a video on a previous one, but this actually looks cool. In the Aquas Hail Ventus format. And here is Dragonoid Tutorus. Ooh. Wait, what at what element was it again? Um Oh, it's Chaos. The darkest Pyrus one is Pyrus. Unfused. 
But this actually looks cool. Look at it. I love it. This is actually my first one. And I'm... I am happy it's still Pyrus, no matter what. It's still Pyrus. Just not... It's, not, it's just gonna be used in my Chaos deck, that's all. Oh, I hope I find... Oh, wow. Closing them up is actually nuts. Because, you know... This is how you close them up. You gotta do that. Do the wings. Then the fist. Oh, wow. This is really nuts. That's how you close them. That's annoying. I mean, this guy I can close easily because I've done it before and nope. He doesn't want to be closed! Alright, since I'm actually going to need instructions for these guys and I'm going to learn it later. Learn how to do it later, but right now we got one more battle pack to open and yes, and I do mean one more. This is the last one. The next one is Pharaoh Gillator and Pegatrix Goreen. Go in the back, you also get a Maxitor Zentor and Hydrus Batrix and Py Wait, really? Pyrus? <gasps> I don't know if you've seen my video when I did the first Hydrus Batrix, but I love that fusion. It's so beautiful. Oh my god, and it's a Myrus now. Oh, I'm happy. I'm very happy. <laughs> I need to get this open right now. I need to. All right. Okay. All right. And voila. Okay. So. Wow. Oh man, the Bakugan the Bakugan Tower has gone so big. This is every Bakugan I gone from all these packets. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. All right. So let's have a look at these abilities first. So we got Pegatrix and Gorin Ultra, which is 500 B power, one crit, gets five Craven Lands and an in shield, and six energy to fuse. Yep. 1200 B power, 2 crit, gets 10 crit for Lantern on Orange Shield. Alright, next up is Maxator and Zentor. 200 B power, 5 crit. Oh, that's interesting. To fuse, you need to land on a Magic Shield. Ooh, alright, that's interesting. And once fused, it has 400 B power and 7 crit. That has to be like the weakest fusion I've encountered. Alright, so it comes with Scorching Swords, meh, Hydra's Bat Tricks, 400 B power, 4 crit. You need to land on a Fire Fist to fuse. Let's have a look at this baby. Oh my god, look at this beauty! 600 B power, 6 crit, oh my god, I love it! Alright, Unholy Bow, again. Alright, Foul Gillator, 400 B power, 4 crit. Costs five energy to fuse. And woo! Oh! Oh, I like that. That just. Hang on. I had to do that. I just had to. <laughs> 1100 B power, eight crit. Alright, so the abilities. Ooh, whoops. There's a flip strike, which has another back of fusion in it that's also currently out somewhere. And Magmagon. 1200 B power! Damn! And after all that, no back, no abilities from my Oralist back again. I mean, the only pack I knew I was not gonna expect it from was the starter set. <laughs> I was at least gonna expect something from. I kinda knew I was not gonna get anything since I had one Oralist core. But I was expecting something from the battle packs at least. But alright. 
so getting these guys out. Ooh, tricky. Start the gear first because that looks the easiest. Ah. All right. Gotcha. And the rest are just push. Yeah, that's why there's one leave. Ugh. So let's have a look at these guys. This is Pegatrix right here. No, not Pegatrix, Pharaoh Gillator. So I'm just getting the box so I can see how the back of the gear is supposed to go on them. Because you need to have a look at the damn box. I kind of, it's actually a good design. I kind of like it as an Ultra. I like Pharaoh as an Ultra, it looks pretty cool. So. You put the gear on like that, and then this part goes on like so. It's not bad. Kind of like this. And here's Pegatrix with Goreen. It's just a buffed up Pegatrix. That's what it is. It's a buffed Pegatrix. Oh my god. So let's have a look at these things, guys. My favorite fusion first. Which always gets me happy to see. My god, look at you. You are so beautiful. And this new fusion. Well, not bad. And with that, that is every Bakugan from all those back packs. Damn! Just. Oh my god, this is all of them. All of them. Oh my god. Whew, I think after all that, I at least need a break until 2021. Oh my god. Oh, anyway, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and hope to see you next time. Get up.